Hi everybody, it's Deb here with Creative Life. Welcome back to my channel and thanks so much for joining me. So today you guys, I have a really fun surprise for you. I have been asked to join the Clear Scrap Design Team and I was so excited to join this team. Um, they have some really fun products in their store. Uh, they have shakers, they make um, chipboard pieces, they make wooden pieces, they make uh, lots of different wooden or shiplap type um, products for home decor that, or that you can decorate for wreaths making and things like that. Um, so I'm going to share with you some things that I got from their store. I just got my box in the other day. So it's kind of like a bo unboxing but, un but sharing. <laughs> so um, so I'm going to go ahead and grab um, all of my stuff and I will be right back. Okay, y'all, so here is my box and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to zoom out just a bit more. There we go. So um, let's go ahead and open this up. So I did go through it. I had to go through it because I had to see, make sure everything was in here. So I did see everything already. So I'm pretty excited to share with this with you. So um so some of the things that I got um, were substituted uh, for other items. So um, just so you know. And um, so let's start with the stencils. Two stencils I got were the Hello Fall stencil. And I cannot wait to use this. Um, I think we're going to, you know, fall is coming up. And so we're all gearing for fall and Christmas. And so I think it's really going to be fun using this. I think it's going to be super fun. The next thing I got was uh, this heart um, stencil, and I just thought it was really a fun stencil, um, and it's an arrow heart, so if you can see, it's shaped in an arrow, and I thought that was really fun, so I thought this would be really fun on a layout or something, um, think that this is really a nice uh, stencil to have. So there's that. Um, the next thing I got in here, I did order a bunch of different type of sequins and things, but I think that some of them were out. So we're just going to go ahead and go through these ones that I got. Um, this one is, I don't know, let me look on the list here, you guys, real quick. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo, sorry. Hmm. Okay, this one is the holiday sequins, I believe. So this one is really, really pretty. You get a bunch of different red, white, and green, and little uh, glitter pieces in there. I think that's so pretty. So can't wait to use that. Of course, that's for Christmas. This one is black and white, and so I think this will be really cool for Halloween. This one is actually called Wedding, and I think this one was a substitute for one of the other ones that I had um, was going to, uh, had asked, or, and so this one is, uh, this one is the Wedding one, and so a black and white, I think it'll be great for Halloween. This one right here is Butterfly Melody, and how cute are those little butterflies in there, right? Oh my gosh. And you get all kinds of different colored ones. So cute. This one is um, a winter flake mix. And so you get red, or not red, I'm white and blue and a light blue color in there. So pretty. Um, this one right here is called candy mix. And so this one has a bunch of different candies in it. So fun. So I think that'll look really super cute. This one right here is called Baby Confetti, and I think that is going to look cute in a couple of things that I've got in store for us. So those are some of the fun little sequins and um, uh, shaker mixes that I got. Now let's go ahead and I'm going to share with you um, a couple of these things, and these are going to be super fun. So this one right here is actually a, um, it's a picture uh, board, like uh, wooden, it's like this. So you put it together and you have like a picture and it's like this one down here, right there. 
So you, have, you could put a picture in it. It has, comes with a base, so you could uh, put the words in it. And you can actually, um, you can remove these picture uh, boards and the words as well and put other ones. So you can interchange these with, um, you know, words and things like that. So you could do spring, you could do welcome, you could do um, home, all kinds of different ones. So, so cute, right? How cute is that? So I love that. So that is a good idea. So um, if you like to give pictures, uh, gift pictures to people, or you like to um, do one for your own home decor, this would be a great one to do. The next thing I got was... Um, this uh, chipboard scallop index piece and of course it's already got the notches for you so you can make your little index cards and it, this one's got the scallops on it so pretty and you get um, three or no two of these in here let me see I think you get two. Oh no you get three yeah I thought I thought it was three pieces yeah so you get three pieces in there Okay, so how fun is that? So you can do three of those. And um, so we're going to hang on to that for a second. The next one is the acrylic pieces. And with this one, you also get three. And um, this one is going to be super fun to decorate, you guys. I cannot wait to share with you what you can do with some of the acrylic pieces that you get from Clear Scraps. I think it's going to be super fun to decorate. This one right here is the high back um, DIY wood box. And actually, this is for your Memdex cards. So this, these two actually go, or these three actually go together. So um, if you have Memdex cards or you're um, doing swaps a lot and you need a wooden box, this is perfect for that. Now they've got this one here and they've got a long one. And this one right here, it says um, several sites, several styles and two sizes. One is four in seven, or uh, it would be seven, four in three quarters by twelve, and one is four in three quarters by uh, six. So you've got a long one and you've got a short one, and this one has the high back on it. So I cannot wait to see how this works. I'm really excited to put this together and to share these with you. So the next thing I want to share with you is, oh, here's another one. Here is another Memdex. Now these ones are new. These ones have the little tabs at, on them and I think these are super, super cute. Um, I just think that this is going to be such a fun little um, decoration uh, Memdex cards to decorate. I think these are going to be so cute. So there's that. And then um, I have, now I did get some shakers, but I want to share some of the other things with you guys first. So let me share. Um, okay, so I'm going to share these. Uh, let me see here. Hold on. I'm going to share these items with you. Okay, so I'll share the wooden items with you guys, and I'll leave the other ones here in just a second. Okay, so the next thing I got was, now this school with the apple can actually go along with this little frame. So how cute is that? Because you can slide the word and the apple into the little, um, see these little grooves right here? You can slide your words into those. And that's why I was saying that this frame is interchangeable. So you can do school pictures. You can do family. You can do a Christmas one. You could do, um, you know, Fourth of July, Mother's Day, it, you know, Father's Day, anything with these little picture frames. And um, so, and then she has words, either she has the wooden words and she also does, you um, chipboard words okay so uh, you can definitely interchange all of those words with these frames so fun this one is a little wagon with the word gather and this is what i was talking about so like this right here says gather and it has a little uh, um, wagon on it and it is super cute so again see how they did a little frame here and they put the little word and then the little um 
uh, flip flops. Um, you can actually put change those out and put the little gather and then put the little wagon on there. How cute is that, right? The next thing I got was this little birdhouse. And y'all, I haven't worked on my birdhouses in a long time. Um, and I need to do one. But using, when I saw this birdhouse, I absolutely had to have it. And so I definitely got it. And I can't wait to use it. So cute. And so again she has a lot of different wooden pieces and this is the shiplap uh p wooden pieces here on the back of there but um i just love 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 that so i had to get that then i got this shaker heart wooden uh mini album and um this is so fun you guys i'm gonna take it out for a sec Okay, now it is a wooden shaker album, and this is why. So you have two pieces of the hearts. You've got your, your base piece. You have your acrylic piece that you are going to put on there, okay? And then you've got your piece that goes behind there to put your shaker pieces in, right? And then you've got your other back piece, okay, to hold that in place. So how fun is that, right? So you can put your shaker pieces in here. Um, I thought it would be cute and just you could decorate this up however you want. And then you've got your little pieces for your mini albums. I think it is so stinking cute. So so that that is like a little mini album that you could do. I thought that was super cute and um, it had shaker hearts in it. So, oh my gosh, so that would be super cute. So, there's that. The next thing I got were um, some chipboard items. Now, the chipboard items that I got um, are various items. And um, this one is an ornate lock. And I just thought this was so, so pretty. I love the little heart and the details on this little piece so beautiful and then um i got some trees that we can uh doll up and i thought that that would be super pretty um have kind of a thing in mind for, for using this i think it'll be really pretty so there's that i got a christmas tree how cute is that how cute would that be for an ornament or just a little tag to send somebody um, put on Christmas presents or you know just decorate it up really cute how cute is that then we got some candy canes and look at how cute those are oh my gosh how cute are those oh my gosh so so cute so I'm put those on the back of there so you guys can see them a little bit better and I think that this would be really cute with um, some red glitter around it you know um, you know or white glitter I think that that is super super cute so so yeah I already got some plans for these you guys how cute is this gnome chipboard piece oh my gosh that is super cute then this one I they have a girl and a boy chipboard piece like this that this one says girl and they have one that says boy and i think it is so super cute i got to get a hold of the boy one because you know as you all know i'm having a grandson in january so i'm really looking forward to getting the boy one so this piece right here is a pumpkin and i think that this is going to be really pretty um you know for a scrapbook page a card whatever you're doing you could definitely paint this up really nice um, and then paint this up really nice and put them together um, i think that is going to be super super pretty and um, then we've got some butterflies on here and um, they have many different pieces that you can choose from here are some Nordic uh, snowflakes that they have in their shop. And these are really, really pretty. I thought these would be really pretty, just, you know, painted white and then dolled up with some glitter. So pretty. Here is a nice window. Um, I, they have many different windows to choose from, but I thought this one was really pretty. 
How fun is that? This one here is a leaf. Um, let's see if I can find the name. The le it is actually called the Chipboard Circle Vines. So how pretty is that? I love, love, love that. And um, I just think that is so pretty. So I can't wait to use that. This one right here is the double hearts. Okay. And um, so it's a double heart piece. And I just think that that's really pretty. Thought that would go really pretty on a layout or something or a card. And then we have our holly. And how pretty are those, right? Again, doll these up with some paints. And then maybe do some red glitter in here and some green glitter. Um, I thought that would be so pretty. The next thing I want to show you is the shakers. I have two more things left, but I'm going to share the shakers with you first. So the shakers that I got are so super fun, you guys. This one is the flower shaker. How cute is that? Right? Oh my gosh. So stinking cute. And I love it because it comes with... <coughs> It comes with everything you need to make this shaker, except for the shaker pieces, of course. But you get the top flower, you get the acrylic piece, okay? Then you get the, the back piece, okay? So you can glue these two together. You paint them up, glue them together, okay? Put this piece on the back, okay, right? Then you put your, you turn it over, you've got your um, little areas for your glitter. Then you go ahead and you go ahead and put that piece on and then you put this piece on. And there you go. There, that would be your shaker, right? So how cute is that? And so, like I said, you get um, a couple of all your stuff for you to create your shaker, ex except for you just add your, um, your shaker pieces on here. Now it does say that the clear scraps acrylic shapes are crystal clear. So there is a film on those, uh, the acrylic pieces when, when you get them. So you definitely want to remove the um, film before, you know, you add everything together. And we'll be doing one. I'll show you guys when I do my videos. And then I got the shaker stocking. How cute is that? I got a shaker onesie. A shaker heart. <laughs> I got two little shaker pumpkins. And so I thought this would be super cute for a layout. Um, I cannot wait to use them. I think they're going to be super, super cute. Um, I got a cookie shaker jar which is super cute. Cannot wait to use this. Got the shaker truck, you guys. How super cute is that going to be? Oh my gosh. I absolutely cannot wait to use this. Okay. Cannot wait. And then I have the shaker mushroom. Now the shaker mushroom, again, it comes um, with, they have so many shakers. You all have got to go check them out. You will love all their shakers. If you are a big shaker person, um, you're going to love their store. So here, just like that, that's good. That's the shaker mushroom. How super cute is that? I mean, once you ink it up or paint it or whatever and add your little shaker bits inside, how super cute is that, right? Oh my gosh. So super cute. And I am super excited. I cannot wait to get started on my design team stuff, you guys. <laughs> The two pieces I have left are so awesome. And you all, they have the um, shaped wooden boards, uh, different, they have different sizes, okay? So be sure when you look at their, their boards, like this one and this one, they have this in a bigger size and they've got some other ones in some bigger sizes. Now I'm gonna share with you the little beehive okay, that I got, and this is the beehive. How super cute is that, right? Oh my gosh, and now this is, um, it doesn't say the size on this one, but I'm, I'm thinking they might have a, I can't remember offhand, okay, but I think they, they do have a bigger one in this, okay, and so um, I think that this is super pretty. I cannot wait to use this, you guys, so cute. 
then y'all are gonna <laughs> y'all i can't wait to show this this is the gnome girl they have and oh my gosh you guys when i saw this i was just like oh my gosh i have to have it so this is the cute little gnome girl and oh my gosh isn't she super cute and um she can hold something in the middle so that's why i thought you know what I really thought that that shaker flower would be super cute in her little hands, right? How cute is that going to be? Or you could do a stocking. Um, you could do the cookie jar. You could do a pumpkin. Um, you could do the little um, apple. There's a little apple that I have. Um, I just think that this is so, they have so many different cutouts. Now, she does come in a bigger size, okay? Um, uh, I don't know the sizes offhand. You would have to go to the store and take a look. I will definitely leave the links down below for you um, to their store, okay? And I will try to link everything that I got. Um, and um, if I can't, I will definitely leave the link to the store because this is a lot of stuff. <laughs> So, so I will try to leave and each time I do a project I will definitely leave a link to the specific items that I'm using okay so um, anyway so this is the little uh, gnome girl and she is stinking adorable I cannot wait to use her so um, she uh, I just can't wait can't wait so <laughs> So anyway, so this is my uh, design team haul unboxing for Clear Scraps. And so I thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that you all check them out because they have some really fun, fun uh, things in their store. And um, just really just really fun. And so anyway, I hope you guys check them out. I'll leave the link down below for you guys. So take care. And I will talk to you soon. Happy crafting. Bye. Thanks so much for joining me today. Please head over to Clear Scraps and check out their shop. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And hit that bell for future notifications on all upcoming videos, tutorials, YouTube hops, and my live shows. 4.30 on Fridays Central Time.